Fraser back to Agra on Saturday against Salford. Got the makings of a big game and what I'm sure the whole group's looking forward to. Yeah, it's a big game uh, for us all and, and for me, obviously, because I was there uh, last year. But um, we know what they're about and uh, we've been working on them and um, hopefully we can get, get the result we want in tomorrow. And going to be difficult to do, isn't it? They're a team you know, capable of playing some great stuff and been there more or less the whole season, haven't they? Yeah, I mean, they're right up there and we know what they're about. Uh, we've looked at them, we, we've we've uh, been doing his work on them and uh, like I said, we'll, uh, we've prepared right and uh, we're ready to go tomorrow. And I guess it's one where it's giving them enough respect, given that, you know, top of the table and been doing great this season, but also more importantly focusing on ourselves as well. Yeah, I think we're always main as main focus is ourselves because we know if if we if we're uh, on top form we, we can beat anyone in the league. Uh and we, we do respect anyone we play and we know that Salford are a, are a good team, a big physical team and uh I'm sure we'll be able to deal with it tomorrow. Fingers crossed as it's famous last words, but hoping the worst of the weather's out of the way now. There's a real feeling that last 10 games or so it, it's the running now, isn't it? Yeah, it's a big push now. All the lads are ready. Everyone in the whole squad will be needed because there's a, a lot of games coming thick and fast. But I think for me personally, I'm just keeping my head down, just playing and hopefully playing well and getting results. And obviously, the main aim of uh, getting promoted. And I guess really, there's no need to be paying attention to the league table in so much as win as many games as we can, and you'll more or less be there, won't you? Yeah. Well, I think we're just taking it game by game. We're not looking at the, at the games that are coming up. It's it's one game, get it done. Next game, get it done, and, and get results, which. We will get, and I'm sure we'll uh, we'll uh, get it sorted for uh, promotion. And you've mentioned your time at Salford, obviously last season. You've been in and around that that camp, if you like, very progressive club. Yeah, I know what I know what they're about. I know what the managers are about. So they'll they'll come at come at us tomorrow hard, and uh, like I said, very physical team. So set pieces, throw-ins, all that. It'll be a lot of pressure on us, and it's just down to us to deal with it and hopefully uh, get the result. And Decent attendance in prospect as well, which is always nice for the lads. Good atmosphere. Yeah, I think a good atmosphere always is, is gets the lads up for it, and our support is good as always. And obviously tomorrow will be uh, even bigger, I think. So hopefully that'll uh, that'll keep us going, so we can get the result. And what's it like this schedule now? Because just in the next week, really, three games in in a period of six days, I guess replaces training. Really, the lads just have to keep going and going. Yeah, well, the, the, obviously the training uh, intensity will go down uh, quite a lot because obviously the games and the recovery that's needed. But I think that that doesn't really affect anyone. Um, like I said, we just need to keep focusing on the games, training. We'll we'll do what we do and keep getting the results. Busy week for yourself personally. How did you find it midweek in England duty? Yeah, well, very uh, last minute to be fair, but um, it was a good experience for me. A uh, good couple of days, and obviously the game on Tuesday, so that's uh, another positive I can take from it, and hopefully now I'll take that into my performances uh, for Kidderminster. So, yeah. And literally, when that announcement went out about half past eight on Saturday, that, that was literally more or less the first you knew, wasn't it? It was mm. a very uh, rushed sort of situation. Yeah, I was at home, not really expecting the call, and I got the call and saying, Can you? travel down to Wales uh, tomorrow so obviously it was good for me and my family and uh, that's that's sort of done with now I need to start focusing again on, on Kidderminster and what the aim is here which is promotion.